Do I straight up run when he starts rolling, though? Okay. Survive. Woo! Here he goes, here he goes! Let's go. Oh, he's angry! <laughs> what am I seeing? Woo! Let's run past him! Joe, this way! That's it, buddy! Go! That's definitely gonna break literally any moment. So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back to another episode of three random games And it's that game series where we go ahead and check out three random games from the internet or within the confinements of this singular video Okay guys now let me come clear right now. My brain is refusing to work. Okay I have no ideas for an innovative intro. Therefore, we're just gonna get started with this episode We've got three games to play. I kind of want to churn through them Let's go ahead and do this good stuff <laughs> So this first game is called the mold exorcist supposedly in this universe you combine both not cleaning your your house and developing mold and an exorcist service. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's answer the call. Here we go. We're probably getting that call out. We are the mold exorcist after all. Just calling to let you know that this particular job has a rush on it. Okay. Property goes up for sale tomorrow. So oh dang. Sorry for putting you on the graveyard ship. Mm. Don't worry. You'll get time and a half for this one. Hey, let's go. So okay. You don't contaminate the whole place. Start upstairs. The door's open. You got your mold blaster 9000. I did. Have a mask, headlamp. And you're ready to go. Sick. See you on Monday, mate. Let's go. Do Americans say mate, though? Hey! Oh, we're popping the tunes in the car. <laughs> <laughs> 1 a.m., dude, driving down the street, blazing the tubes, honestly. They know exactly who we are when we drive around, okay? What the mold exorcist? This house was literally built on top of probably one of the worst hills in my life. All right, let's assess the property. They say to start upstairs first. We got the door hanging up. Bro, you probably should focus on fixing up the doors too. You know, not just cleaning it from the mold and stuff like that. Probably want someone who knows how to fix a door on. All right, well, let's get the job done, okay? We start upstairs. All we gotta do is spray this. The dust goes away, or the mold even. We are called the mold exorcist. Do people know how easy- Bro. I think I just had a hallucination from the mold entering the airspace. Don't think about it. Clean away the mold. I think each time we kill the mold- We are literally taking down the mold. And it leaves letting us know. Hold up, one more try. Hold up. Okay, now that one was just disgusting. All right, so we spray the mold. Uh, we get this- Oh. Wait, what's happened, dude? I see no issues. Uh, gotta clean the mess here. That's it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Whoa. Pfft. Why is he saying that? Hold up. Got a light over there. Uh, I don't really understand. <laughs> That's the mold's getting in my throat right now. How about we just ignore the demon cells and get on with our job, okay? We were paid to do this. Therefore, we come out and we do this. They're freaking out of here, mold. You don't belong in this house anymore. Again, with the same sound. You don't scare me, mold. You, you don't intimidate me. You can pop, crackle, you can scream. I don't care. I'm ready for this. All right, I think we just cleaned the whole upper floor. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. You see that mold hanging around the top right there? You gotta move out right now. All right, let's get it. So, Hello? Dude, we're going downstairs. We're gonna complete our job. Don't even think. All right, let's go. So we've done the upstairs. Let's get down. Well, now, that's an improvement. Wait. Hold on, was that my voice? Whoa, hey, hey, whoa, what the freak? Hey, what the heck is this? Demo I'm cleaning, I'm doing this. Let's go, let's go. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's go. Uh, don't listen to the voices or the noise. What is wrong with this job? Guys, why not take this job? What's wrong with me? Come. Where is here? Oh, dude. Look at that. Okay, you're doing chest press. I see that. I don't care, though. Da, 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 da. Keep cleaning. Keep hearing weird squelchy sounds and don't think nothing about it because, guys, nothing can happen. We clean the mold. Like, that's literally all the demon can say, come here. Yeah, pff, not gonna work, fella. All right, that wall's looking nice and clean. You know what, as far as the exit side goes, I'm gonna leave it to the new homeowners to take care of that, okay? Uh, enter the basement. I'm good, thanks. I'll clean this place first. Hit that one up. I think this might be the last mole right here, unless there's some on the outskirts. All right, we're good, right? Oh, he's getting angry. Okay, no mold outside. We're done, though, right? Are we done here? Uh, hang on, let me do this. Uh... I had at the door. Oh my! Dude, I can crawl! What the heck am I? What do you mean it's time? Oh my god. This was literally in that basement. What the freak is this? Why am I a mouse? Bro, you're literally a rock. How do you feel? Okay, okay. Um... 
Woman. I don't like the way you talk. You talk like when people write contracts, you know, and you tick the bo- What the frick did I just play? See? Now this is a game I can get behind, guys. This is called The Interview. We've got those smooth lounge feels as we get going with this thing by Jeff Alday. We're beginning this thing. Success, hey! In our own home, we've got security cameras. We're on total lockdown, guys. Look, I can't even move anywhere without this thing spying on me. By the way, I'm also naked on my lower half, so how you feel? Uh, fridge looks disgusting. Let's take a look. Ooh, kind of a crisis when it comes to food. No coffee in the mug either. Dang, okay, we'll close those. Let's see. This company has worked zero days without an accident. Best previous record was... That, that's not good. Take a look in here. Okay, ooh, peace stew. At least I got one of those. Okay, my favorite. Join the queue, let's go. Whoa! Bro. What the freak just happened? Hold up, mindset is nothing. Your dreams will never overcome your fears. Whatever you are, be a bad one. Better days will... Okay, you know what, guys? This is the last time I buy those anti-motivation posters. Let's go. So I'm joining the queue right now. This queue probably filtered down a lot of our start back there. All right, we got more smooth music. Always be close. Nope. Losing. Hey, how's it going, boss? Hello? Hello? Not quite the induction I expected, but here we are, guys. Uh, hey boss, is that you? This is registration. What do you want? I guess I'm here to register. Let's do it. To register, we will ask you a series of multiple choice questions. How many questions are there? We'll ask the questions, just so you know there are wrong answers. All right. Should your registration be unsuccessful, you will be removed immediately. Wait, what do you mean removed though? Hold up. It's a verb. It means we'll drag you out with the trash. Okay. <laughs> Question one. Do you understand the conditions of registration? Uh, yes or yes? Well, I don't know, boss. I really don't know. Do you agree to hold the organization harmless in the event of injury or death? I got no choice. How do you spend your free time? Thinking about work, talking to other people about work, or working. What is the color of success? Red once I punch you in the face. How will you respond when your superior asks you to redo a task you spent hours on? I will gladly redo the work. I will happily, I will redo my work with abundant air. We'll get it done. What is your work style? Working long hours? It's the same thing, bro. We'll go to the top one though. If you can invent anything, what would it be? Third arm, a pill that eliminates the need to sleep and eat. Office chairs with toilets for seats. Wow. Ooh. Ooh, hold up. A pill that eliminates the need to sleep and eat. Dude, I'm always feeling like sleep is a waste of time. Let's go. Processing answers. Surprisingly, no errors detected. Well, sign me up, bud. You may proceed. Thanks, boss. I appreciate that. Uh, employee, why does the, you know, the office space room lead to another, like, cavernous place? Okay, you don't know? Wait, hold up. The freak is that sound? It's just, like, ambiotic. I'm gonna run the whole way through, though, guys. I don't want to spend my time dawdling around these tunnels, okay? I want to get the freak back out, and I want to land the next place. Uh, hello again. Time to test your problem-solving skill. Tell me more. We discovered the interns changed all the door codes around the office. What did you do when you found out? We terminated them <gasps> permanently. Except Eric, we can't find him. Eric? He is quite difficult to manage. Is that you, dude? He can't keep his hands to himself. Ah, anyway, we reset all the door codes except the one in this room. What do you want me to do? See if you can figure that out. It will show us if your company material. Do you accept this challenge? Let's go for it. Good luck, chump. Don't you dare call me a chump again, all right? All right, let's go. So we're heading here. Lots of office dividers. Is it just a maze, though? Look through this thing. Uh, I see nothing. You see all these paperwork stacked on the floor, though? Okay, yeah, we're definitely the only ones in here. We're probably going to end up getting killed, guys. Let's head on through. So we got a door code. Let's try 3659. Enter. That was worth a try, wasn't it? Okay, well, let's see if there's anything of uniqueness around any of these dividers. Feels like there probably should be something, right? Take a look. Hello? We can search them too. Let's go. Nothing there. There's a seven. That's a start. So we'll leave that draw. Oh! We're at a point in my career where a cardboard cutout is literally a jump scare for me. Hey, get the freak out of here, man. I ain't got time for your business, all right? I got drawers to search. Oh, another cabinet. Here we go. Here we go. Probably the middle drawer, right? A two. All right. Uh, it's cardboard. Be yeah, yeah. I saw your tricks that time, didn't I, Fally? You didn't scare me. Another one here. We've got seven, two... Uh, another two. Okay, final one here. So, 7220. Now it comes like, which order do we put that in? I'll try 7220 to begin. 7220, enter. Nope. Okay, let's try 2720. Nope. Okay, let's try 0722. Wait, if you look at the paper, the small red lines going down each corner, I think that might correlate to their position. So, maybe like top corner is one, that's two, that's three, and that's four. Something, something, two, seven. So, with that, all we gotta do is flip those last two numbers around, right? 2027. Okay, that's not it, so 0227. Yeah, let's go, let's go. I see your puzzles, I see what you're doing right there. It didn't last long, sucker. I'm a genius. Yeah, talk to me, fella. That was a really, really... 
when I meet you, I'm gonna break your nose. You know, you're not very nice. You know, I just don't care. Yeah, I kind of figured that. Let me through the door, man. I can't go through unless I compliment this fella. It was harder than I thought it would be. It was so sad that if I cared, I'd be out of tears. I'm surprised you're not still in there. I get your point. The thing is, we no longer have interns. What does that have to do with me? We've decided to offer you a job. Hey, let's go. I'm as surprised as you. Can you tell me more? It's quite the opportunity. You'll definitely be challenged. Do you accept the job offer? Sign me up. Welcome to the team room. Orientation is this way. All right. Um, probably should have said no, though. All right, let's go. Uh, hold on. We just broke out. The heck? We're still being surveyed. Yeah, I see you too. Let's take a look around here and see what we got. It's just wilderness. It's nature. Like, I'm free right now, dude. Oh, there's a street lamp over here. Is, that, is it a maze, though? Can you- Hey. Have I gone into a maze? Because I'll just go around the side. All right, let's do it. Maybe it's not a maze. Maybe it's, uh, you know, a simple walk around feature. Maybe it's part of the design. Maybe we walk through this and we enter out finally into the office. Well, that was simple, wasn't it? Whoa! What the? Hey, bro, what the freak are you? Excuse me, excuse me, coming through? Uh, okay, there's a button here. Let's go. Hit the button, hit the button. Press it. Hey! He sliced my ankles up, though. Let's go, father. Let's go. Let's go this way. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. We hit the button. We run straight away. Go. Hit the button. Hit the button. Did I not hit the button, though? Oh, he's quick. This thing is quick. Hold on. I gotta hit the button. Come on. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. And around the side. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Don't stop running. <laughs> look at... Oh, we broke out the wall. Go. Don't look back. Don't look back. Ah. Uh, you escaped that wretched place. L let's get it. Uh, what happened now? I guess we got the answer. We escaped the wretched place. All right, guys. So I found a third game, okay? I was looking for something that might try and top the first two games that we played, and, uh... Yeah, this is the best I got, seriously. This game is called Joe's House. It was actually made for John Wolf's Game Jam using the HQ residential house, guys. Like, you see this thing everywhere. I don't know how this thing's gonna work. Let's see these controls. Why does that look like butt cheeks, too? All right. I'm seeing that happy... Hey, I feel like I'm flowing through this, guys. Like, <laughs> Joe's House is a maze building game where you must rearrange the furniture of the HQ residential house to create the longest path from Joe's bed to one of the exits. Sorry, Mike's coming in. This is too sweet. Joe's bed. Starting location of the bed is on the second floor of the master bedroom. To move the furniture in game, you must use the map. Press M. Once in the 2D map, left click on any piece of furniture to drag it and release the left mouse button and drop it. Take me to the next. Holy crap, dude. I wanted to play a game while I'm reading an essay. He's the 2D map to drag furniture and build a maze. The maze will start from Joe's bed. Joe will start lying down in his bed and you must see him to get rolling around the house to either attack or eat pie. All right, uh, I read. Oh my God, talk to Joe. Joe, I think I'm uh, gonna peace out, buddy. I'll be back soon, okay? Wait, I can go. Dude, I can fall. Oh! I think I should probably just talk to Joe, shouldn't I? Yo, Joe. How's it going, big fella? What, what, why, why do you look like this? Hello, you must be Joe Bird. That voice is gonna kill my throat. I am Joe Bezity. I was expecting you. You are here in response to my newspaper ad. I need someone to help me with my medical condition. I have a strange sleeping disorder. I roll out of bed at night. In fact, I don't just roll out of bed. I roll out of the house. Once I roll out of the house, I endanger innocent civilians. Your job is to keep me in the house at night by whatever means necessary. All right, Joe. Wait, please come in. Uh. How does Joe have a front door? That doesn't act like a front door, Joe. How are you doing this, you wizard? Open the door. We open the door. Let's close the door. I, I closed it on my face. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome to my house. It's very nice. Make yourself at home. You can start setting up the house for the night. My bedroom is at the top of the stairs to the right. At night, I will roll out to the front door. The first thing you may want to do is barricade that front door. You can use one of the barricades in the garage. This man invites me in his house and literally says, start nailing down the front door, buddy, because I'm, I don't want to leave my house. Uh, so we press M, so barricade the front of the door. We got an objective. All right, let's, uh, let's get it, guys. Let's get it. I never asked you to open, start closing, that's it. Well, I'll just be going about the house. Confirm me when your preparations for the night are done. Also, a light gives me a headache, so I keep the place dark. Use your flashlight to get around. Let's go! Hey, look at Joe. Oh my god, you got a bit too much back meat, buddy. Guys, I'm just not gonna talk. I'm just gonna get some epic shots with this music to show Joe. Give me that, okay? We drag this down, okay, to the front door. Let's go right there. All right, let's check out our handiwork. Hey, yeah, how you feel, Joe? You can't leave this place now. So what about if I take this one? Can I... You rotate, and you put it by the door. He had leaving. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. Literally everything in this house is movable. So let me get rid of that. Oh, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. We put this thing right there. 
Ooh, I like that. I like that. That's fortified. We'll take a sofa. We'll place that guy right there. We'll take another sofa. And this guy's going by the other door. So Joe surely can't get out, right? Yeah, he ain't getting past that. Let me check out here. Perfect. Yeah, good luck, Joe. You're screwed. I'll put that by the window just in case he tries to break out. That looks pretty good to me. Press E to open. Ooh, yeah, he'd definitely be trying that. Okay, I think that's pretty good then. All right, so I've put literally furniture everywhere, guys. Look, Joe can't even go to bed. Let me just talk. Are you finished setting up the house for the night? Press Y to start and press N to keep preparing. I, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going to be honest, Joe. Let me inspect your work. There must always be an accessible exit in case of fire. Joe's inspecting. Let's stand back. Uh, what do you see? Uh-huh. Are we good? Well, this is a clear violation of the fire code. Please fix this so we can get out in case of a fire. Bro. What the freak do you want me to do? All right, guys, so I'll leave one of the garage things open. Let's talk now. Uh, let's see what he says. I approve of this. Off to bed I go. All right, Joe. Go to bed, fella. Guys, I don't think I've done well. Can I now barricade? You can't move furniture in the night. Uh-oh. I think we're gonna get our necks now. Hold up. Guys, this man's about to break my neck in the middle of the night. All right, so Joe goes off to slumber. Go talk to Joe in his bed. All right, let's go ahead and do this, uh, you know, this bull crap. Oh my God, Joe, I can't tell where the bed cover starts and your belly ends. Thank you for bringing me my medication. I'm going to sleep now. Okay. I <laughs> How'd I die in 0.1 seconds? And I have to do it all again! Guys, do I straight up run when he starts rolling though? Hold up. Okay. Survive. Woo! Here he goes, here he goes! Alright, let's go, let's go. Bro, he's angry! <laughs> what was he? Oh my god, throw it, throw it. Drop it, drop it. Bro, we dropped the pipe. Oh, he's still. He's going for the pipe. Move! Alright, here we go, here we go. Guys, he's already done with the pie! Bro, hey Joe! Hey Joe, look this way, big fella! Look this way! Drop the pie. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Woo! Let's run past him! Joe, this way! That's it, buddy! Go! <laughs> We nearly had it. All right, guys, this time I've put the other sofa, like, slightly in the way of the door. I'm feeling like maybe this will slow Joe down, and if not, I might almost build, like, a maze-like system here, because then it will really drag out... Joe, why is your hand floating through the floorboard, buddy? Go downstairs instantly! Okay, we can't get out here. Let me see what he's doing. Okay. Uh, I'll lead him back this way. I think he's coming for my back, mate. Not sure. We'll confirm very soon. Let's see. Oh, he's rolling. Oh, he's rolling. Hey, Joe! Joe, no, you don't want to go there, fella. You want to come this way? Joe? Joe, I've asked you nicely. Look at the pie. Look at the... Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back. Let's go. Joe? Joe? Listen to me. That's it, that's it, that's it. He's coming for me. He's coming for me. Make sure. Yeah, he's following. Oh, he's following suit. We bring him upstairs. Go hey, Joe! You've got distracted. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Hey, Joe. Joe, Joe, Joe. This way. Buddy, there's a pot. <laughs> this is actually difficult, though. I don't understand truly what I'm doing here. Hi, this spawn. Do I look like I care? All right, guys. I've straight up built a maze going through the garage now, like... Oh, well, I was standing here so I can test this thing out. Look, now Joe has to come all the way around here. He thinks he's got the exit. Nope. Nah, buddy, he can't get through that. Yeah, that, that looks good. Sick. That's awesome. Great. Joe, just <laughs> go to bed, all right? Dream about escaping. Don't actually do it. Well, have I close the door on Joe, though? Did he fuse? Ah, yeah, he's unaffected by doors. Silly me. How could I have been so stupid to not realize that? All right, guys, let's do this, okay? Bring him this way. Drop a pie. Here we go. Ooh, he goes straight for it. All right, Joe, you gotta look at me, fella. Gotta look at me. Come on. Time. There you go. There you go. Let's go. Keep him in our ladders. Whoa, I'm stuck. <laughs> oh, guys, he logged onto me for a bit. Hold up. I'm slowing him down. Come on, Joe, talk. No, 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 don't close him. No. He's literally about to escape. Don't let him do this. Don't let him. Guys, I'm taking night one as a complete victory on this game. This is actually really difficult because of his AI. Joe, we're messing up your second floor. I'm done with this. Bro, I've glitched the game. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get around here, but Joe can. You're kidding me. No way, because of the bookshelf here. Guys, I can- Wait, I can jump in this game. I had no idea. I, I still can't get around this, though, so... Uh... I will never be able to talk to Joe in his bed. Ever. Yeah, we changed the layout here, guys. Look, we got kind of like a little network system. We have to have that exit open, though. Joe don't like it when it's closed. I focused a little bit more on... Well, I sealed that off with the sofa. But in this room here, you see we go around. Kind of a little maze in here. We're just going to slow this dude down enough. Wait, did we mess up his bedroom? We forgot to mess up his bedroom, though. All right, look at him. Rolling around like a ping pong ball. Look at this. Oh, he's got some speed. <laughs> Lean him in here. He's coming. For no, no, no. He's going for the exit. It's so hard to know when he locks onto you, though. Hey, Joe. Joe, this way. Joe. Joe. I'm so close to him. He won't lock onto me. Joe, lock onto me. 
And then it's too late. Oh, guys, I'm gonna drop a pie here. Hold on. Let me try and get behind him. Oh, there we go. There we go. Hey, Joe. Joe, this way. Joe. Oh, he's coming. Yes. Good, good, good. Good. Jump. Woo! All right. Oh, oh, okay. We had his attention for quite a while, though. That was decent, right? Pop the table. Beat him to it. Beat him to it. All right, here we go. Here we go. 25 seconds. If we keep him here, drop a pipe. Get around and get around him. Okay. He has to lock onto us for a bit. Let's see. Let's see. Come on, Joe. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. This is our chance. This is our chance. Come on, Joe. I think we've done it, guys. I think we did it this night. Oh, I think we've done this, even though he's got no time to escape. Look at him try it. Keep your distance. Let's go. Let's go. Let me just see. You think you got it? Just oh, he locked on again. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> I hate Joe so much. It should be here. I'm not, I'm not going through there. I ain't going through there. If I see him trying. Joe, I think we've won this, guys. I ain't even going to do anything. Let me see. Joe, how are you doing? <laughs> Where am I? Oh, it looks like you did it. You kept me from leaving the property. This is very impressive. I, I received three pies. And he moonwalks out. Bro, I'm done with this man's job. You know what, Joe? Yeah, it was good to try out the job and stuff like that. But you're going to have to find another client, my dude. Uh, I'm done with this one. I'll be seeing you. Let's get it. This game wants to trap me in a world where all I can do is do this for Joe. Yeah, you can skip that. All right, guys, well, that was another episode of Three Random Games. Uh, I had no idea I'd end up getting so invested in that final game. That literally took everything out of me. The games are pretty cool for this one as usual, and I just hope you guys did enjoy this episode of Three Random Games. But for this one right here, this is where we're gonna leave everything, and I hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one. I'm done with Joe's house, bro. Never going back. Thank you.